I wanted to address something real quick um, because I'm watching back the fight with Fulton and Inoue and a lot of the comments in my video and in a lot of other people's videos as well is that yeah Fulton's a disappointment, Fulton's a piece of shit boxer and you know it was embarrassing that night etc etc and I'm gonna have to disagree with you 200% if you believe this then you are an absolute fucking idiot Fulton is a world class elite boxer the problem was is that he he had the wrong game plan the entire time with Inoue. He wanted to stand and bang with Inoue. He wanted to trade in the pocket. And that's respectable. Yeah, he has that fighting spirit. That's commendable to, to have that. And he's a very, very talented boxer. He will whoop my ass. A box will he'll whoop me at this stage and point in my life. Perhaps in the future, say something else. But I, just read more, I, I mean, the truth, yeah. But, and he probably whoop your ass too. So please put a bit of respect on his name before you talk shit. In no way is the power of power number one best in the world. Like, even though if Volton wanted to win, he'd have to win my points. He'd have to be on Floyd Mayweather. He would have to be, incre be incredibly comfortable moving backwards. Adopt the Philly. He has such a good Philly shell, but he didn't. I don't really see a Philly shell this time around. He would have to stick to the 1 2. His 1 2s were very, very crisp, and when they landed, they were very, very crisp. We see Inouye's head whipping back. But the problem was is that it didn't do enough damage. You can't knock out in no way. You can't. With it, the fourth level of power, it's not, it's not possible. What's the noise? Um, knockout record 22 and uh, 22 KOs with a 25 and, um, 25 and 0 record. Fulton's record is 8 KOs with a 21 and something 1 record now. At the time, it was 21 and 0 record. This is quite a considerable record, very impressive, of course. But, but, <laughs> All the guys that talk so much shit are the guys that just don't box in general. They just watch. You know, it's so dumb to see. Like, you don't know what, what the stakes are like. You know what the nerves are like, bro. And you're just standing on the side. Being a fucking hater, being a gremlin. Fulton is not a bad boxer. Just because he lost the best, bro. And I hope, I hope, I, so, I hope to God, like, we can see a really big comeback for Fulton. It's so fucking dumb, man. I want to make that quick. I want to make that quick video. Say that I don't know how much I can say. He should have just been. He should have just adopted a, a complete male with the style. It's just yeah, starting bang is completely incorrect. It may if May with him, and then as well got some comments saying as well, oh, because he's a black man. He's a black man, bro. What, what, what if two black guys fight? Bro, are you talking? Oh, but the Asian guy beats the black guy for uh, for the first time. But you always talk and you always talk and compare no anyway to Manny Pacquiao because they're both Asian. And there's a clear double standard here. And the best thing you can do is shut the fuck up and watch the boxing. Seriously, like nobody gives a fuck. Nobody gives a fuck. If you're good at boxing, you're good at boxing. Done. Period. Like nobody gives a fuck, bro. He's so dumb. Just to say, oh, he's, he's just because just because he's a black fire it takes away so much from actual like, very very talented black fire as well. You know, so like people that, that think about this way are very very one dimensional, and very stupid, and um, yeah, just you know, annoying to think about. It's really fucking annoying, man. Fulton is not a bad boxer. I, I hope he has success in the future. Catch you guys in the next video. Peace. Leave me open. I'm mediocre.